Located near Naples, Italy, you can spend a day or half a day exploring Pompeii. If you're a little short on time, follow this list of highlights to get the most out of your visit. The huge ruins of Pompeii are famous all over the world. People travel all over the world to walk the same stairs as those who lived in ancient Rome. Destroyed and preserved by the volcanic eruption of Mount Vesuvius, this lost city offers a perfect snapshot of life 2,000 years ago. With its incredible charm that explains the society that thrived here, Pompeii is a wonder and a must-see. Here's a quick look at some top 10 things to do in Pompeii. Hello and welcome to our channel. In today's video, we will discuss top 10 things to do in Pompeii. If you are new to this channel, don't please forget to subscribe and activate the notification bell icon. So without further ado, let's dig in. Number 1. Amphitheater The oldest Roman amphitheater to date, this theater once held a whopping 20,000 people. It is said to be a very popular spot for the people of Pompeii, with past entertainment including the famous gladiator games. With the top section of the amphitheater still intact, take a seat and be transported back in time to the ancient times of Pompeii. Located on the edge of Pompeii, few tourists visit the amphitheater, especially in the mornings and late afternoons, giving the arena an eerie atmosphere. Number 2. Public Baths Bathing was an important part of Roman culture and Pompeii was no exception. As a community activity, public baths provided citizens with a place to clean and refresh themselves after a day work. They were about the size of public pools today, with separate tubs for women, men, and slaves, and sometimes even courtyards that served as outdoor pools. Number 3. House of the Small Fountain This attraction is small but packs a huge amount of beauty. Once home to a wealthy family, the villa is full of stunning architecture, preserved frescoes and famous fountains. Fountains are the main reason tourists set foot there. Decorated with colorful mosaics, shells and small bronze statues, it is a fine example of Roman architecture. Number 4. Visit Villa of the Mysteries The Villa di Misteri or Villa of the Mysteries is a well-preserved rural Roman mansion on the outskirts of Pompeii. Buried in the eruption of Mount Vesuvius, the mansion has been excavated since 1909. In addition, the villa is known for its first-century frescoes in one room depicting young women, representing the secret religion of Greece and Rome. Number 5. Term del Foro. The spas of the Forum are a Roman spa complex capped by the eruptions of Mount Vesuvius, discovered after archaeological excavations in ancient Pompeii. The Forum spa was built in the 1st century before Christ after Pompeii was taken over by the Romans in 80 before Christ. The spas were then restored during the Julio-Claudia age after the earthquake in 62 Anno Domini. Number 6. Garden of the Fugitives Behind Pompeii, this ancient vineyard is a haven for the 13 victims who did not make it out alive. These plaster casts reflect the dramatic events that took place after the eruption when people tried to escape unsuccessfully. It revives the horrors of Pompeii's inhabitants' tragic death.
Number 7. Scavi di Pompeii. Archaeological excavations in Pompeii have restored what remains of the ancient city of Pompeii on the Sibia Hill. Scavi di Pompeii, along with Ercolano, Stabia, and Oplotes, were covered by a colander of volcanic ash and lapilli during the 1979 eruption of Mount Vesuvius. This site in Pompeii exceeded 3 million visitors in 2016. After an archaeological tour of the Pantheon and Colosseum, Roman Forum, and Palatine. Number 8. Temple of Apollo. The Temple of Apollo is a Roman temple depicting the Greek and Roman god Apollo in the ancient Roman city of Pompeii. Facing the north side of the city, this temple is the most important religious building in the city and has an extremely antiquated state of origin. Number 9. Teatro Grande. The Grand Theater of Brescia is Brescia's main musical theater in Pompeii. Its name comes from the former sect of Napoleon Bonaparte. The first public performance took place in the 16th century at the Teatro Grande of the Accademia degli Erranti in the Republic of Venice. This foundation brings together the integrity of the city in fencing, science, profound quality and dance. Ten, Sanctuary of the Madonna of the Rosary The Pontifical Shrine of the Blessed Virgin of the Rosary is a Roman Catholic house of prayer in Pompeii. This Roman Catholic church, like other churches in southern Italy, has rich frescoes, fine art, and incredible engineering. This quiet place is frequented mainly by locals who come here to pray. So guys that's all for today's video. What topics would you like us to cover in the next videos? Let us know in the comment section below. Share this video with more of your friends. Like and hit the notification bell icon to never miss out any of our latest updates. Have a nice day and I will see you later.